Hello my dear children today we are going to discuss a poem from our ninth class english textbook it is from unit 2 b reading and its title is what is a player it will be a silly question if i ask you who is he sachin tendulkar a world famous cricket player of india what qualities do you think made him god of cricket with his more than 20 years of excellent performance he stands as a role model for the young players with strong determination dedication and discipline he reached his target he set many new records in the history of cricket so it is apt to say that sachin tendulkar is a true player this poem is on the same theme which explains the qualities of a true player let's start This poem is written by Jessica Taylor. She was born in Louisiana. She is a young poetess. She has developed her love for music and poetry at an early age. Most of her poems have focused on emotional issues with an emotional touch. Loneliness, I miss you, I hate and I'm worried are some of her popular poems. Now let's see the meanings of the words used in the poem. Give up, leave, whine, complain, pondering, thinking about something carefully for a period of time, contemplating, considering about, chicken out, to decide not to do something because of fear. What is a player? In the present poem, the title of the poem is a question and the poem itself is the answer for it. The poetess lists out the qualities of a true player in each line. Let's read on the poem to understand what a person should possess to become a successful player. Before explaining the poem, let's read the poem once. A player is one who does not give up at the sight of defeat but learns from their mistakes and puts them beneath. A player is one who does not give up at the sound of the buzzer always giving what they have from one side of the court to the other A player is one who does not whine about their playing time because a player knows it's an unacceptable crime A player is one who practices game speed always keeping in mind that their shots are not guaranteed A player is one who does not settle for anything less even knowing that they are not the best they will the ones you see outside practicing day or night rain or shine they are the ones running on hurt ankles admitting they are fine a player is one who has a strong sensible mind never pondering about failing only contemplating prevailing a player is one who does not chicken out who wants to be in the game when everything counts now that is a true player Now let's begin the poem. A player is one who does not give up at the sight of defeat. According to the poetess, the first important quality of a player is he should try and try till the end, though he knows that he is going to lose. But learns from their mistakes and puts them beneath. Though he makes mistakes, he learns from those past experiences and overcomes them the next time a player is one who does not give up at the sound of the buzzer a true player should not end up at the sound of the buzzer and always try to give what he has always giving what they have from one side of the court to the other A player should put his 100% efforts to win and face the opponent. A player is one who does not whine about their playing time because a player knows it's an unacceptable crime. A true player never complains that he did not get enough time for play as it is well known that doing so is a crime. which is not acceptable 
A player is one who practices game speed. Every game has a particular time period. So, a true player should always practice his game speed so that he can play the game within the given time. Always keeping in mind that their shots are not guaranteed. A true player should always remember that all the time their shots or trials are not successful. He should be able to accept the failures and success equally. A player is one who does not settle for anything less, even knowing that they are not the best. Though he knows that he is not the best, he should not settle for anything less than the victory. They will be the ones you see outside practicing day or night, rain or shine. The true players are always seen practicing their game. He does not bother about the time, whether it is day or night. Even if it rains or sunshine, he keeps playing. They are the ones running on hurt ankles, admitting they are fine. The true players keep on trying and practicing, though their ankles get hurt. They will say that they are alright, because they take injuries very light. A player is one who has a strong and sensible mind. A true player is one whose mind is strong and sensible to take wise decisions and day steps. Never pondering about failing, only contemplating prevailing. A true player never think about losing the game. They just consider about the present game and how to play it. A player is one who does not chicken out. A true player is a person who will never decide to be idle because of fear or lack of confidence. Who wants to be in the game when everything counts. Now that is a true player. He will never give up and leave the game but will stay in the game till the end as he knows that everything is important beginning to ending and these are the qualities of a true player. Now let's see the summary of the poem. According to the poetess, a true player should not give up at the sight of defeat. He should learn from his past mistakes and correct himself and also forget them. A true player should not give up at the sound of the buzzer and always try to give what he has. He should not complain about the playtime as he knows that it is an unacceptable crime. He should always give what he has from one side of the court to the other. Though he knows he is not the best, he should not settle for anything less than winning. He should practice regularly. He should practice under any circumstances that is either in day or night or in rain or sunlight. He should always keep in mind that his shots are not guaranteed. He should remember that success and failure are common in games and sports. Every game has its certain speed. So he should practice accordingly. He should not complain about the playtime. He should be ready to play at any time and any conditions. Though he practices vigorously and gets hurt, he should admit that he is fine. He should take the injuries light. He should have a strong and sensible mind. He should not think about the failures of the past but focus only on the present game. The true player is the one who is never afraid of anything. He should not be disturbed and lose confidence. A player who wants to win the game should not chicken out at any time. Hope you understood this poem and enjoyed it. Thank you for watching this. Keep learning.